Welcome to SS Tutorial. Today I came here with one more new video. This video is going to be on a very important topic. So please don't skip and keep watching. In our previous video, we learned about meander. Today in this video, we will know about one of the most important landform that is Oxbow Lake, which is actually a result of meandering. So let's begin. At first, we will know what is an oxbow lake. An oxbow lake is nothing but a abandoned loop lake forms due to meander cutoff found in the middle and lower course of a river. Almost every big river makes oxbow lake in its course. Oxbow lakes are also famous as a horseshoe lake or a loop lake or a cutoff lake. Now question is why it is called as oxbow lake. Actually, shape of this type of lake have similarity with an oxbow. That is why it is known as oxbow lake. Sometimes due to similarity of horseshoe, this type of lake is known as horseshoe lake. Let's know about the formation of an oxbow lake. Before we know about the formation of an oxbow lake, let's know some facts about meander. Because oxbow lake is a product of meandering. In the middle course of river, river flows very slowly due to lower slope of the land. In this situation, if river gets obstructed by any obstacle, then due to lower energy of the river, river flows by turning and starts lateral erosion and forms meander, which we bravely discussed in our previous video. Every meander which forms an oxbow lake has a greater curve, which has two types of bank. They are concave bank and convex bank. In which part of that curve have greater radius is known as concave bank, where velocity of water is higher as water flows greater distance. As the velocity of water is high, lateral erosion and undercutting occurs on the concave bank of meander. But in which part of that curve have smaller radius is known as convex bank, where river velocity is lower. As water flows minimum distance due to lower river velocity, transported materials by the river water are accumulated in the convex bank of meander and makes sand bar, which is known as point bar. Thus, as a result of long term erosion and deposition, two river bends increases and get closer to one another. After that, river cuts its neck, which is actually a small piece of land between two bends and river flows straight rather than by turning and makes a new channel or new way. Here we have to remember that these new straight river channel are generally made by two ways. It may form either by lateral erosion and undercutting of the river or by the flooding. Over time, river cutoff or meander loop get closed by river deposition and form a lake where water movement stopped and water remains still. As water movement stopped in this lake, it gets abandoned marshy land and over time it gets dry due to evaporation. When it gets dry, then it is known as meander scar. This meander scar may fill by water in the monsoon season. There are almost a few years to a several decades may takes to form a meander to an oxbow lake. Here a most important and interesting fact about oxbow lakes we must know. That is, oxbow lakes are formed when erosion, transportation and deposition process of the river works togetherly. Sometimes, oxbow lakes are made artificially for using in multipurpose field. There are many oxbow lakes are created artificially in the river Mississippi, Rhine, etc. Let's know about importance of oxbow lakes. Oxbow lakes are most important. They can be used as water source, they can be used for irrigation purpose in agriculture. It is very rich in wildlife habitats. When oxbow lakes are dried, it creates new land, which can be used for farming, housing and for industries. River Mississippi, Rhine, Ganga forms many oxbow lakes in their course. Arkansas Lake in North America created by Mississippi River Kanwar Lake in India created by Gondog River, a tributary of Ganga, are most notable example of Oxbow Lake. That's all for today. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, then please press the like button and share with your friends. 
to get more new video please subscribe my channel thanks for watching